family, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Angela. Here on this channel, I create beauty, fashion, and lifestyle content, in particular for the woman over 40. But if you're under 40 and you're watching this video, you might you might get some tips. It might be able to help you out as well. Today's video is definitely a style video. I have put together five looks, but while I was putting together these looks, I had four goals in mind. The first goal was comfort. I'm going to be wearing these this week and I'm going to be in and out the door. I'm going to be doing a lot of running, running around. Don't want my feet to hurt. Don't want anything too tight. I really want to be comfortable. The second goal was to make certain my outfits were hot weather appropriate. Okay. Um, I'm in Texas. Oh, it, it, it says 100 degrees. It's hot outside. It is hot outside. And I want my outfits to be as cool as possible. I also don't want to freeze to death when I walk inside a building because we know the AC is on everywhere. But I want to be cool. I don't want to be hot um, when I'm running. And I do mean running or walking briskly <laughs> from the house to the car, from the car to the building. That is goal number two. The third goal was to make certain that my looks are very intentional. I didn't want my looks to be haphazard or want it, want it to look like I just ran in the house or I was just up and I just grabbed a pair of shorts, a pair of shorts and a pair of shoes and ran out the door. I want the looks intentional because I want them to look very cohesive. I wanted it to look like I thought about that look. And, and that way it's going to make me feel better and the outfit is honestly going to look better. And the last goal was to create some blended looks. And what I mean by blended looks are looks that are, that have budget friendly and luxury pieces. Now, that being said, budget friendly and luxury are relative. And I'm talking about for my particular budget. So budget friendly to me, you know, it's budget friendly based on my, based on my income and how much money I have and luxury is luxury for me based on my income and what I have. So you'll be able to tell what I mean by that by, based upon the pieces that I'll show you. Now, if you'd like to see the pieces that I put together, then stay tuned now, let's get started. Before I get started, this is my outfit of the day and this is somewhat a blended look. Um, the dress is not luxury, but I, I don't, I wouldn't, de I would definitely not call it budget friendly. I think it was um, originally priced $180. I did get it on sale. I bought it a few days ago. I do have the exact same dress. You've seen it before. Let me get it for you. Here it is. You all have seen me with this dress before. So, and it did come in this beautiful, when I say this, this orange is fantastic beautiful, beautiful, vibrant orange. It is bold, it is rich, and I think it's fantastic. It came in this orange, it came in white, and it came in that black with the um, embroidery on the side. And the only reason that I did not get it in white is because I have two white dresses about the same cut. Uh, I think one is from Banana Republic, I can't remember where the other one is from, but I decided I would go ahead and get a different color. And this orange one does not disappoint. Now this, the white one I think and the black one are still regular price at $180. It has pockets, it is linen, it is lined. As you can see here, the cut is fantastic. The craftsmanship is wonderful. It's simple, but it's chic and it just looks very elevated. It doesn't need much, you don't need much with this. I tried it on with some white sandals and it just was not given what I wanted it to give. I'll show you. So take those off. I had these on at first, these white slides from Kohan, and I just felt like it was just too much of a contrast, and I wanted it to look very cohesive. And so I was like, no, that just, that's just not doing it for me. And so I took those off, and I tried these shoes on from Amazon, and they are perfect. It's the snake print. I have the, these shoes in several colors. Where are the other ones? Oh yeah. I have it in this vibrant, <laughs> vibrant, vibrant green. Now I haven't worn these yet, but I will. And I think I have them in a orange. Where's the other ones? Oh, they do, I do, I'm so good. And I have it in this metallic orange as well. I could have, 
I could have done it with the metallic orange, but I really like it with this snake print. It just feels very cohesive. It almost feel like it's in the same color pattern. You know, an animal print is a neutral. So this is a neutral shoe with this orange dress. But this is my look of the day. So this is look number one, and it definitely checks off all the boxes. This is an oversized linen shirt. I love this color green. It is perfect for spring and summer. It's just beautiful. And again, it's linen, so it's comfortable. It's a bit oversized. It's not snug. I'm gonna be comfortable in this look all day long. I have on some cutoff denim shorts, and I'm pretty sure I cut these off myself um, from some old jeans that didn't fit anymore that might've been too big comfortable i have slides on now the entire look is hot weather appropriate of course i have on shorts the linen is going to allow me to breathe or allow my body to breathe it's going to be cool it's going to allow the it's going to absorb sweat if i start sweating and it's going to evaporate really quickly it's a natural fabric so it's great for spring and summer the look is very intentional i love pairing uh, this color green with a navy. And so I have on my Dior purse and it has the navy print and Dior slide. So that green and blue look fantastic together. So I paid attention to the details. The shoes do match the purse. So the look does look very intentional. And it is a blended look. The shirt I think is from Zara. I've had it at least a couple of years. The shorts were almost free, but not free. But if, if you were looking for something like some shorts like this, my recommendation is to cut off a pair that you already have. If the pants are too big, if not, go to a thrift store, Goodwill, grab your pair of jeans that are like a little bit over, maybe one size up, because they'll be so much more comfortable when you wear them. Cut them off a little bit too long, put them in the washer, wash them in hot water, and get them nice and clean, put them on. If they're still too long, you can cut them a little bit. Um, don't cut them too short, because you can never make, them too, never make them longer again. And so I paired it with my Dior purse. The purse and the shoes were not cheap. I'm just gonna say that. So this is a very blended look. It's comfortable. I, I really love this combination. So this is look number two, and it's probably gonna be my favorite. Y'all know black is my favorite color. Now, this is comfortable. The shorts are comfortable, the top is comfortable. I have on flats. It's a very, very comfortable look. It's hot weather appropriate because the shirt is linen, even though it's black and it's long sleeved. I have the sleeves rolled up. It is linen, so it's gonna be cool. Um, the shorts are linen as well, so that's gonna keep me extra cool. And I have on sandals, my feet are uncovered. So, you know, to balance out the long sleeve of the shirt, even though I have it rolled up. So I'm definitely going to be cool. The look obviously is very intentional. The black and white theme going on. The black shirt, the white shorts, the black sandals, the black purse. I think this is so pretty. This is definitely a me look. Definitely a me look. And it is a blended look. I think the shirt is from, pretty sure it's from Zara because when they were selling, they were really um, selling the uh, linen shirts. I bought almost every color. The shorts are from Banana Republic. So they're, they're probably a little expensive. I think they were around $100 when I purchased them. I have, I got three pair. The shoes are definitely, <laughs> they're not budget friendly. They're Louis Vuitton sandals. I purchased these when I was living in Saudi Arabia. I think I got these in, either I got them in Riyadh or I got them in Dubai. And the purse is Louis Vuitton as well. So they match the sandals, but yeah, I think this is my favorite look. I love me a black and white number. It always looks so chic and so elevated, but this is the look. It's cute. I could wear this anywhere. I could wear it to brunch. I could wear it It'd be my day look. I could take it to dinner if I wanted to. I probably would change up the shoes to something a little more dressy. Um, but if not, if I wanted a casual feel, I'd be okay with that too. This is a perfect summer outfit. So this is my next look. This is so comfortable. This is this is definitely an everyday, I'm not trying to do anything stressful today kind of look. So this shirt is from this sweater vest. It's from Banana Republic. And even though it's a knit, it is sleeveless. And the knit is a wide kind of holy knit. So air can definitely get in here. So I don't get hot. The shorts are a pair of chinos from Gap. I think I have these in like three different colors. I have them in this khaki and I have them in a navy and I think I have them in a white or probably black. I know I have them in navy, probably black. And I paired them with this straw purse that I picked up from, 
TJ Maxx or Marshalls when I was out of town. I saw it and I thought it was really cute. I think I got it not to go to the wedding, but I just saw it and I thought it was really cute. So this was definitely budget friendly. Normally, I'm probably sure I didn't pay over $35 for it. And on my feet, I have uh, the not so budget friendly um, item of the group. And it's these Louis Vuitton slides. Love them. I love them. And I, the reason I bought these because I've been looking at them and I bought Birkenstocks guess, a couple of years ago and I wear my Birkenstocks all the time. And this is a similar shoe. So I knew if I wore those all the time, I would elevate that look and buy a pair of Louis Vuittons and I would get a lot of use. My cost per wear would be perfect. So, and I do wear these all the time. They're a neutral shoe. They go well with brown and black or just a solid white. They look fantastic. I'm gonna round this look off with my Fendi shades. They're not budget friendly either. I bought these probably six months ago and they look pretty. They're brown, so they look perfect with this outfit. It just kind of finishes the look. You can definitely recreate this look very easily. These shorts are very accessible. If you don't want to do the Louis Vuitton slides, uh, Birkenstock have so many different styles. If you always looked at them and thought, because I usually think those shoes are not pretty at all. As a matter of fact, I didn't like them whatsoever. But I was like, oh, let me give them a try. Everybody has them. They put now I know why everybody has them. So you can get some Birkenstocks, find you a uh, budget-friendly purse, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, everywhere, Target, Kohl's, Walmart. Everyone has something similar to this or a straw basket, at least for the next couple of months until the end of summer. But, and get you some shades. You don't have to get a Fendi pair of shades. You can get some shades from Amazon. Amazon has great shades. But this look is definitely recreatable. So this is my next look. You know I'm gonna be hard pressed to create a video, a styling fashion video without a one and done. Y'all know I love my dresses. Um, this dress I've had since last year at least. It's from Banana Republic. It's one of my white dresses. I love, when I tell you I love a white dress in spring and summer, I love them. They're just so easy. All you gotta do is pull your dress, just just any, mini, mighty, mow your shoes, pick it. <clears throat> Oh Lord, <coughs> don't you put that in the video. <laughs> Let me start that over. <laughs> so all you have to do is pull your dress out of your closet. You can any, mini, mighty mo your shoes, grab your shoes and then match your purse to your shoes or whatever the look you're going for, out the door you go. So again, this dress is from Banana Republic and it is comfortable. You see it's not fitted, it's A-line, it's beautiful. Perfect for comfort, perfect for style. Um, definitely hot weather appropriate because it's just loose. The air can get on under there <laughs> and cool everything off. It's not quite a long sleeve. It's like a three-quarter sleeve. I didn't button it. Sorry. Oh, one side is button. One side ain't. Let me, let me get this real quick because that would drive me crazy. Okay. Three-quarter sleeve. The look is very intentional. The shoes are from Zara, and I've had these shoes at least three years and I what I like about them they're just simple and I like the pearl detail it makes them look a little more elevated the the pearl is white the dress is white so it makes it look much makes it look very intentional but these are I just think there's something chic about a pearl whether it's on your shoe a brooch whether it's on your outfit a part of your wardrobe your dress or whether you have a string of pearls it's just something chic about that in my opinion it's just my opinion so I have these. The purse is from Teddy Blake. You know, I, I got this when I did a collab with them early on in my on, on my YouTube channel. The Teddy Blake purses are genuine leather. They're um, I think they're made in the U.S. I'm almost positive they're made in the U.S. Or if they're made not made in the U.S., they're made in Italy. Beside the brands that are making the higher price purses, but it is a genuine leather purse. The craftsmanship is set. The craftsmanship is exceptional. Um, my bag has the feet on the bottom. I chose this Robin's Egg Blue. I think it's beautiful. Now, this isn't a budget-friendly piece, but it is affordable. Now, when I say affordable, that means I think it, they, they usually have them on sale around 300, 400, I think max in this size. So if that's something you can't swing with at one time, you can save up and purchase it. When I say affordable, I say compared to other purses like the Louis Vuitton purse that I had, like you could buy 
five of these for the price I paid for that purse. And it's just beautiful. I love it. The craftsmanship, it has a um, strap. I love, I love me. Look at that. Isn't that cute? So I can wear it like this or I have take the strap out and wear a crossbody or wear it on my shoulder. But the look is very cohesive and it's a blended, but not necessarily a blended look. I, I say blended because the purse is at least $300 or over. I need to wear you. I ain't wore you in a minute. So this is my final look. And I love this look too. It's black and white. <laughs> you know, I love my black. Um, it's comfortable. It's comfortable. This is my favorite white button down shirt. I buy it again and again and again. I just love the cut of it. It just fits perfectly. It has darts in it. So it kind of goes in at the waist and goes out a little bit. It's really comfortable. It's from Banana Republic. And I think it's called the Riley shirt. I've been buying it for years. They have a Riley too. And I think the Riley too has a large um, cuff at the arm. So this is very comfortable very hot weather appropriate the shirt is white it's cool it's long sleeve but i have the sleeves pulled up the shorts are linen so it's gonna let again let the air come in it's gonna let everything breathe <laughs> um it looks very intentional it looks very cohesive this look does not look haphazard whatsoever i paired it with these Givenchy silver sneakers and this cute purse that i bought probably two years ago and it says fashion made me do it and so the the shoes are were not budget friendly. They were expensive. I don't remember how much I paid for them, but they were not cheap. They're Givon cheap, of course. The shorts are from Banana Republic. They were ninety, I think about ninety dollars, and it, it wasn't that long ago. And it was not that long ago when I would have said ninety dollars for a pair of shorts. <laughs> no, ma'am. Mm -mm, not me. But uh, I've, I've made a little bit more money now, so I can afford it. So. I think that I think they're worth it. The craftsmanship is excellent. The cut is excellent. And I just love the feel of the linen. And I just love the the cuff at the bottom. No, these aren't the ones that are cuffed. Oops. So I guess you cut that out. I just love the cut of these and they're just very, very comfortable. This shirt, the Raleigh shirt is under hundred dollars, somewhere between I think 75 to a hundred. The bag was under hundred dollars. I do have on a uh, Hermes belt. It, that's not budget friendly either. And I've had, but I've had this belt probably five years at least. I'll have this belt in my wardrobe forever. So the cost per wear is excellent. And I got the one that looks hammered. I didn't get the the flat silver because I knew I was gonna get it scratched. It's gonna get scratched up because I'm gonna wear it. So this has the hammered finish. So it looks practically brand new. But this is the look, it checks all the boxes of my, my goals for the day. The comfort, the hot weather, appropriate, the intentional, looks very, the silver, black, and white is a beautiful, beautiful color combination. And the blendedness of it all. The shoes are expensive. The shorts, I would say, are somewhat expensive. The shirt, under $100, but still not cheap. The quality is fantastic. And the purse is under $100 as well. The belt was expensive too, but this is the look. It's very comfortable. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna wear this tomorrow. But this is it. Well, that's it, family. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you did in the comment section or give me your feedback. If any of the pieces or something similar is available, I will leave them in the description box below. I know that this dress is almost sold out. They have the smaller sizes available and it did come in regular, petite, and tall sizes. So if it's still available, whatever is available, I'll put a link to it in the description box. It'll probably say orange dress. Now, no matter where you are in the world, know that you are loved, know that you are meant to be, and know that I appreciate every moment of your time that you spend with me. And also know that I want you to have the most blessed, blessed day. Bye-bye.